Hunting. No quarters required. Hang on. Do you have a license to hunt at night? Because you need a license. <laughs> I thought you were serious. Come on, now. You know I don't give a f What are you eating? I call this Turf and Turf. It's a 16 ounce T bone and a 24 ounce porterhouse. Also, whiskey and a cigar. I'm gonna consume all of this at the same time because I am a free American. The cigar's inside, sir. Fine. I will smoke the entire thing outside. Even though it is bad for me, I am going to do it. Show these garbage people out. Take the garbage out, Eddie. Donna? Gentlemen. Who or what is Penny Saber? It's a free circular with a bunch of coupons in it? This was sent to Ron Swanson at Diane's address, where I've lived for less than a month. How is that possible? This is an extreme invasion of privacy. The right to privacy is very important to me. My family has had a single P.O. box for several generations. We only ever subscribed to two magazines, Reader's Digest and Ebony. Ebony was due to a clerical error, but it ended up being an interesting year of reading. Donna, can we use your lake house? How'd you know about that? My family has a lake house up in the foothills, but we keep it quiet. We're not big on hospitality. The Meagles are a cold people. Can we use your house? I suppose. Bring your own towels. You want to see me? Yes. I need to ask you for a favor. What? Ron Swanson asking for help? Keep your voice down, woman. Part of the Unity concert is a youth review about the history of Pawnee. They require volunteers, so I want you to come with me to my daughter's public elementary school to help make costumes. The elementary school. I'll do you this solid, but you're gonna have to keep an eye out for my ex-boyfriend, Joe. He teaches music at that school and he is a nightmare. He's my Tammy. You're Tammy. Donna, my two ex-wives are the worst people in the world. Tammy, too, once seduced a coroner and had me declared legally dead just so she could get a discount on a plane ticket. When I'm with Joe, he turns me into a person I don't like or recognize. I go insane. All I'm asking is for you to keep him away from me. I understand this problem well and agree to this exchange of services. There's no vans within 50 miles and for some reason, no one wants to lend me $10,000. Even if we had the dough, that bunko artist would just demand more, trust me. Don't move. Let's just stay here for like an hour and not let him out. This isn't right. Our girls worked hard. We're so close. Whoa. <laughs> I know he didn't just hit my baby. Hey, what the hell, guys? Move. All right. Y'all got your seatbelts on? Oh! Ah! Did you see that? That son of a bitch just rear-ended me. Am I dead? What the hell? Exactly, Bill. What the hell? You just rear-ended me. That is not what happened. But I got witnesses. Yeah, it went down exactly the way my girl said it did, you mean bald man. Hey, what about you, Mr. Uh, a man's word is sacred? Well, it is, but you're an ass So we can settle this now. I will accept payment in van rentals. Yeah! Don? Do I look like I drink water? Oh my God, is that genuine? Mm-hmm. Why do you have Genuine's platinum record on your wall? Why do you have a photo of you with Genuine at some place? Oh, have I never talked about this before? Genuine's my cousin. Genuine? The Genuine is your cousin? How do I not know this? <gasps> oh my God, whose baby is that? That would be mine. Guys, get in here. Ron has a baby. Oh, Ron, cool baby. Thank you, Andrew. Everyone, I'd like to introduce you to my son, John, middle name redacted, Swanson. John was born some time ago, weighing multiple pounds and several ounces. Much like his father, he is a fan of silence. 
Please keep your voices down. How am I supposed to keep my voice down when you had your baby? And you didn't tell me that you had your baby. Why would you need to know something like that? Why would I? Oh, my God. I have not even sent Diane a gift. She's just walking around, wondering why I haven't sent her a gift yet. Should we do something? Just let her tire herself out. What are you doing? I'm getting a picture of you volunteering at a public elementary school in case I ever need to blackmail you. Uh, that's Joe, 12 o'clock. Donna, how are you? It's, it's really nice to see you. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much for helping out. These kids are so lucky to have your fashion expertise. Hello, Joe. My name is Ron Swanson. I am Donna's work proximity associate. Oh my gosh, Donna has told me so much about you. It's nice to put a, a face to the name. Mm-hmm. Well, I gotta get back to my classroom. It's a pleasure to meet you, Ron. And if either of you guys need anything at all today, please do not hesitate to ask, okay? I'm on to you, friend. Well, Tread lightly. Okay. Hey, Donna, what the hell? You know I can't be around smoke or fatty tuna. Run. At first, this was funny, but it's gotten out of hand. This was our chance to vent about work, and you've taken it over. Yeah, it's sushi and cigar club now. Wow, OK. I see how it is. I feel bad. I don't. This is a Cuban. This is Yellowtail. I feel amazing. Whoa! Monster in the window. You know what my biggest complaint is? I have a million things I need to complain about, and I can't take them home because Chris is the most considerate person in the world, and he just wants to help me, and then I feel bad about that, and then I get annoyed that he wants to help me, and I feel even worse about that. I thought you guys would be cool with me complaining since all you do is sit here and complain without judgment or guilt, but you know what? I guess I was wrong, and you know what? I would yell some more, but I think I just peed my pants a little bit. What's happening now? Is the nurse upset? I don't care. Now that's what I call shooting. Is this a hunting game? Yeah, it's fine. You want to play? Indeed I do. If you'd like, I could offer you some pointers. Hunting, Donna, is about silence, balance, and patience. Get ready. Hey, you know you're supposed to hit the deer, right? Ugh. Get it together, Swanson. Well, the game is absurd. I mean, this gun is lightweight, there's no sight, and we are far too close to these deer. Would they not smell us? I want my money back. How do I get my quarters? Oh, my god, you are such a sore loser. I am not a sore loser. It's just that I prefer to win, and when I don't, I get furious. Employee! Oh, you failing it? <laughs> wow, you suck at this. Donna, please back up two paces so I can physically destroy this machine. Can you chill a little, man? It's not real hunting. It's just a game that you happen to suck at. You know what? That's a good point. What, that you suck at this? That it's not real hunting. Come with me. I honestly don't care, but I'm just going to say it. I like Joe. He's a nice man who's good with kids, and he seems to be smart and patient. I know, that's why he's my Tammy. I'm a social butterfly. When we're together, all we do is have sex, sit on the couch, eat homemade pasta, have sex again. Enough. He's constantly being respectful, wanting to spend time with me, trying to connect with me. It's a nightmare. I become boring. Live your life how you want, but don't confuse drama with happiness. Swanson. This handsome spiritual cowboy may actually be right about turning to the east. I have an idea. You trust me? Donna, this is crazy. Typhoon is an artist, and the human head is his is canvas. Just listen, you're going to cut the man's hair, you're going to charge him $8. It'll take you four minutes. So just shut up and make the man look like this. Fine. Ugh. So, Typhoon. What do you like to do for fun? I'm writing an electronic opera about Brittany Murphy, and I do the chandelier design for my friend's drag puppet show. No further questions. All I really want to do is dance. Except lately, all the good warehouse raves are filled with Euro trash. Euro trash? I like that. It is indeed a garbage continent. Yes. Oh, my god, I had the worst time in Berlin last May. Everyone was on their stupid bikes. I was like, ew. <laughs> Please talk more about how you hate Europe and bicycles. John Ralphio. 
You got him right here. Leave a message after the beat. Why do I want you as my assistant? For starters, access to the illest clubs. And that's just for starters. I will work for you. I will be on you 24-7. I'll be like your family. I'm here when you get here in the morning. Sure enough, I'll be there tucking you into bed at night. Don't worry, it's not gay. Do we have questions? I think our only question is, uh, when can you start? Right now, let's do it. Thank you for coming in. We will talk. Cool, I feel good about this. And you know you can hit me up on Facebook anytime, day or night, you know that, right? Take care, buddy. Boom. So what do you think of your new assistant? I wanna punch you in the face so bad right now. What? Okay. Message received, I'll keep looking. Thank you. Bring me the opposite of him. What up, Big T? Stop. This must be the lovely Donna. Ashante. Listen, beautiful, let's cut the bull, right? You want this. I definitely want this. TH wants this. Let's seal this devil's three-way right here, right now. Step one, we buy into this club. Step two, we roll over to the club, either in your Mercedes Benz or my pre-owned Acura Legend. Step three, I dagger you on the dance floor. Just bounce, 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 bounce. Now all the ladies say it. Bounce, 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 bounce. What do you say, sexy? I'm out. Why? I hate that guy. Safety basics. Donna, can you tell me why it's bad to look down the barrel of your gun? Is that a trick question? No, Donna, don't. Please. Rule number one, do not point the weapon at a person. That includes your own face, Donna. Is this all the eggs we have? Yes. What are you making? Eggs. Red alert, Swanson. Your ex-wife is back. No kidding, Donna. Not her. The other ex-wife. Tammy won. She's in your office. <laughs> wow, Donna, this place is beautiful. Yes, it is, and it will stay that way. These are the house rules. No dirty shoes in the house. Upstairs is meagle space only. And if you listen closely, that is the bubbling of the hot tub. You do not have access to it. If you follow these rules, we won't have a problem. No. Ron. What are you doing here? Running away from my problems. Come on in. Okay, so here's what's going on. I didn't on ask. On Friday, I'm supposed to announce that I'm running for city council. And I haven't told Ben yet. I know I said that we broke up, but we couldn't. We're still dating. But now I have to break up with him for real, but I don't want to break up with him because he's so cute and he's so nice. And if you're going to stay here, there are three rules you need to follow. One, no talk about Tammy. One, two, no talk about Ben. Three, no talk. I didn't even ask you last night, what is going on with Tammy One? You just violated rules number one and three. You lose your coffee privileges. Uh. Oh, you choose, nope. Hunting, fishing, or drinking. I'd really love to shoot a gun right now. Fishing it is. I was shot in the head with a shotgun! Hey, Ron, it's actually not that serious. I just need you to stay calm, okay? Yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna stay angry. I find that relaxes me. Okay, Ron, we called 911, and they're gonna send a ranger. Oh, damn! This is a mess. The Rangers won't let us come back next year. You know what? We're not going to think about that right now. You guys, can you just put him on the daybed in the carcass uh, room? Daybed? Yeah. Okay, sure. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Donna? Ah! Donna? Okay. Okay. Donna? Donna? <laughs> Okay, here's your scotch. Okay, Jerry, Jerry's here. Here's go. your scotch, Ron. There, there we go. go, Ron. Okay. Hey, you know what is great? Anne's gonna take care of you. And Anne is the best nurse in North America. All right, here we go. Uh, uh, what, you okay? Did you, did you shoot me? What? No. There was a bird kind of near me, and I know how desperate you were to prove yourself. No, no, I swear I didn't. Ron, I swear to God, I've never shot anyone. Well, you better find out who it was, and then purchase them a coffin because I'm gonna rip them apart. Okay. I shot Ron Swanson. You shot my Mercedes? What? No, 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 no. Fresh air, 
real weapons, an honest kill, there is no substitute for the real thing. You want to go back and play that video game, don't you? Yes. Damn it! Excuse me, worker. Bring me a bucket of beers and four hot dogs, please and thank you. Why are you covered in blood? Don't worry, it's not human. I hope you've made peace with your god, small electronic deer. Come on, come now on. Now that's what I call come shooting. On. That's a new record. Hey, look at that. You finally made it in the top 10. Now you can enter your initials. My initials are private. Well, then just put in any three letters. Ass. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you.